Yeah, it, it's, it's 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 a sad day for us. You know, with, with our seniors going out like this, I, I really feel for them. Um, but you got to give my own the credit. I mean, they played. I thought a terrific game. Our guys battled. Uh, every time we made a run, they hit two or three threes. I thought, you know, our, our I thought we were a little slow to loose balls. I mean, you know, it may have been last night's game. We just didn't have. I don't think our legs like we should. But to play a team like this, you got to be on on full tilt the way they're playing. And um, you know, our guys battled. You know, they battled all year. They, they've accomplished a lot. Uh, Two guys sitting next to me, Clarence and Ryan, will go down as being part of you know some of the greatest teams in Siena, and uh, they're great kids. And uh, you know, I, I just it was a pleasure coaching them this year. Question? Hey Ryan, Ryan, was it, was it the loss or more the way that it ended? A thirty-point game that, that hurts more at this point. Loss is a loss. Um, could have been thirty, could have been one. Doesn't really matter. We're not playing tomorrow. You guys came out with 3.30 to go. What's going through your mind on the bench those final minutes? Start with Ryan. Um, I mean, at, at the time, just got it, you know, it's, it's actually over. But, you know, I didn't think, you know, I don't really know how I feel, but, you know, it was over, but it was definitely um, a pleasure watching uh, Cruz hit that three and found him now, uh, redeem himself with those two free throws. Bars? Um, just keep fighting. Um, you know, we had nothing to hang our heads for. Um, and, you know, you know, so unfortunate that we brought this way, but, you know, our, our guys continue to fight. And, you know, like Ryan said, when Cruz hit that three, you know, just stood up and kept clapping. Did you feel like the Manhattan game took its toll at all in the second half of this game? Uh, I just think, like Coach said, you know, we, we kind of just, you know, let down a little bit. Um, you know, we had them going for the first half, and then I think we kind of just, you know, we just kind of got lost, and they were in every shot, so it's kind of hard to win a game like that, and especially turning it over as well. All right, so it was still a ball game early in the second half, and they scored 13 straight during that stretch. You had a charge, and it was at that point, are you thinking, is it it's desperation time? I got to try to maybe take over the game, or get something going? I think I was forcing stuff too much, um, you know, and I. I knew at the end of the game, you know, I was just trying to just help my team win. And, you know, I was unfortunate that I had a couple of overhead turnovers. You know, I just kept competing. That's, that's what I can do. Brian, it was such a close game <coughs> early in the second half. Were the guys a little shell shocked by how quickly you got out of hand? Yeah, I think, um, you know, like Coach said, they got on the run. And then, you know, in the, in the first half, able to answer those runs and keep it within, you know, five or six. But, uh, Second half, they just kind of blew it off, and we, we couldn't recover. <coughs> Ryan, you mentioned Cruz and Finland, but also he Priestley came in and got a put back right away as soon as he were on the bench. He just kind of um, relate what that was like seeing him do that. I obviously came in with knee fire. It's one of our, you know, one of my best friends, my roommate. Um, couldn't be prouder of him. It was four years. Obviously, he didn't have the best uh, career on the court in terms of playing time that he would have liked. But I've never seen someone come to practice more willing to just work hard, knowing he's probably not even going to see the court the next day or that next game, and hasn't seen the court in multiple games, but still works as hard as he can in practice, off the court, in the classroom. And, um, you know, he's, he's just a great kid on and off the court. Clarence, it's obviously so soon after the game, but can you, I mean, you guys went to three NCAAs. I mean, how, how much fun was your career? I mean, we are very fortunate, honestly. You know, a lot of guys don't even get to get the one. Um, you know, we had a lot of experience. We played some great players. I'm sitting next to one of the greatest players that ever come to the program. And Coach B, you know, giving him his first head coach job. I mean, it was just a great experience. And, you know, I couldn't ask for it to be in a better place. Ryan, can you appreciate what you accomplished here with the three titles? Or is it a little, you know, a little raw right now? Just the um, I mean, I, I definitely can. I'm sure I'll think about it, you know, later in the week or something. But I couldn't be happier with my... Uh, you know, my career here in terms of my team success and just the experiences that I've gone through. Like Client said, there's going to be probably eight, eight other senior classes that we came in with that don't know what the NCAA tournament's like and we were fortunate enough to be there three times. So it's just um, it's been a phenomenal ride. Coach, uh, I don't obviously like to talk players and play fast. Do you think your team maybe got caught up in that a little bit, kind of sped up too much? Excuse me, playing 
I I only like to play at a high, fast tempo. Yeah. Do you think your team maybe got caught up in that playing that style? Well, you know, yeah, probably. I mean, we took some some shots that probably were quick. You know, that we probably should have had a little more patience. But uh, you know, I, I didn't think we played that much faster. You know, I thought I thought I only just played really really well. I and mean, they just. All aspects of the game. I mean, when Machado and Glover are clicking like that, it's tough. Two great players. One more question. Anyone? Did Glover just kind of take over the game at times, just with his athleticism? He, he played well. Yeah. He, that was the best game against us, Mark. I mean, we, you know, he, he 31 points, 11 rebounds, so he was pretty good. Thank you, Coach.